everyone. I'm going to show you how to find the probability. So basically binomial probability at this time by step crunch. All right. Before we do that, we must know the common words here. At least means it's greater or equal to like this. Okay. And most is less than or equal to. Okay. It's less than and so on. So I'm not gonna go over everything here. So you must know everything, all right? So it's between inclusive and just uh, no equal sign there. With just between, okay? Uh, then let's go to homework. Share screen. Share screen one more time. I think this one. Okay, um, it's so hard to see, huh? Let me see here, okay. Uh, let, let me read, even though my pronunciation is not that great, okay? A large fast food restaurant is having a promotional game where game pieces can be found on various products. Customers can win food or cash prizes. According to the company, the probability of a winning price with any eligible purchase is 0.187. So this is a probability, okay? Well done. This is a probability, okay? The first problem, and then, um, let me read that. Consider your next 28 purchases, purchases that pro produce a game piece calculated below. So we know this is a binomial, okay? So N will be 28 and P equal to 0.187, okay? Now, the first one, what is the probability that you win five prizes, prize, prizes? Right, okay. So then this will be exactly five, right? Okay, let us do this, okay, by stack crunch. So stack crunch here, let me write down. <laughs> N equal to 0 0.187, I'm sorry, N equal to 28 and P equal to 0.187 and we want to know probability exactly five, right? Okay, so this will be X. So let us type there. Let me show you, sequence. All right, so we're going to stack calculator binomials because we want to know about the probability about the binomial distribution, right? So stack, stack, calculator, binomial, okay? Let us click. All right, then look, let me make mm, center. N equal to, what was it? Um, N was 28 and P was for probability, right? 0 0.187 and the X is exactly, so we're gonna choose exactly five, okay? Compute, this will be, let me make a copy, okay? And let us go to there, paste. But then they said at least four decimal places. So one, two, three, four. So we just chop off there, okay? So we round at the four decimal places, okay? Now, secondly, it's more than seven prizes, right? Then more than will be, it's greater, right? Okay, 
So let us go to stick crunch. We're gonna use the same N and same probability. I mean, it is the same. And more than, more than is a greater, no equal sign. And um, how much was it? Seven, right? Seven. Okay, compute. So four decimal places, they want. So one, three, seven, two. But then look. The fifth one is nine, right? Nine is greater than five. We do round up. Round up means we give it to one in the fourth digit, right? Decimal places. Then it will be point one three seven three. Okay. So we're gonna type that one point one three seven three. So point one three seven three. Okay. Now how about this one? It's a between four and six. And this uh, and that <laughs> they say that inclusive, inclusive means included there, right? So we make an equal sign. Okay. So four to six. I'm going to stick crunch. So we are using same ends and probability and between. So I'm going to click this one between. So click uh, between six and how much was it? Six and uh, four and six. Uh, between four and six. Okay. Compute between four and six, right? Uh, the probability is 0.5357. And then fifth, fifth one is also five, okay? So five is the same as five. We do round up. Once again, round up means we give it to the one in the fourth decimal place, right? So it will be 0 0.5358, okay? So let us type that point, point, Five three five eight. Okay. All right. Let's do last one. What's the probability that you win four prizes or fewer? So if they say fewer than four, we have just a uh, less than, right? But then four pri prizes, right? So we make a four. I mean, included four there as well. So we make here, go to standard one more time. All right, so what was it? Fewer than and included four, so less than or equal to, okay? Four. All right, then compute. So let us check that. 0.3785 and fifth digit, which is three. Three is less than five. We just uh, chop, right? So we're gonna have a 0.3785. So let us just make a copy and paste this one. Copy this one. Paste. Okay. All right. So, one thing is very important. You should know the common word, uh, change it to inequality symbol. Then, by using stack crunch, it's really, really, really easy, right? I hope this helps you. Thank you. Bye.